Providing access to observe the entire sky, Gemini is an international project centered around twin 8.1 meter reflecting telescopes, one in Hawaii and the other in Chile, two of the best observing sites on the planet. Achieving first light in 1999, Gemini has made major contributions to astronomy, including observations of the formation of the first galaxies in the early universe. observations of stellar evolution and the confirmation of the discovery of the first earth-sized exoplanet orbiting within the habitable zone of another star observatory sciences consultants can trace their involvement with the gemini project back to the 1990s from commissioning of gemini north through to a succession of new projects upgrades and redevelopments we have worked with gemini colleagues from many countries based on different continents despite the distances involved much of the work has been done in the uk simulating telescope facilities where necessary and traveling to the telescopes to perform final testing and commissioning of the systems as part of its responsibilities observatory sciences developed the control system software for the two telescopes this involved the integration and testing of several subsystems to meet the original design requirements one of the most interesting jobs was developing the software to acquire targets for the telescope The user can click on a sky image and then point the Gemini telescope simply by dragging the cursor to the required position. We also improved the telescope's image quality by providing an open loop model of the primary mirror surface at different elevations. Observatory Sciences was also involved in the development of the bench-mounted high-resolution optical spectrograph for Gemini in Chile, an instrument used to obtain very high-resolution spectra of astronomical objects, working with the Optical Science Laboratory at University College London. We initially contacted Observatory Sciences because we needed some software support. It was going to be quite a small project initially because we were building a high resolution optical spectrograph and we needed some support on the software. But um, after we started working with them, um, the remit expanded and they were involved in the testing, the commissioning and actually helped us out in Chile as well. The high resolution spectrograph probes the heart of stars by converting the starlight gathered by the telescope into the spectrum of colors and then analyzing them. The Gemini instrument is well suited to studying stellar populations in the Milky Way, stellar populations in the Magellanic Clouds, interstellar and intergalactic media in the local group, and magnetic fields in late type stars. We were working with Observatory Sciences at University College London to build an incredibly high resolution optical spectrograph for the Gemini telescope in Chile. Um Observatory Sciences were helping us at UCL, but then they also helped us out in Chile. because we packed the instrument up into 28 boxes flew it out and then reconstructed it at the telescope most recently observatory sciences consultants worked on the multi conjugate adaptive optic system for gemini a project using leading edge technology to overcome the effects of atmospheric turbulence on the telescopes observing over a wide field of view up to 5 powerful laser beams will be launched from the Gemini telescope in Chile to allow atmospheric disturbances to be modeled accurately. The multi-conjugate adaptive optic system aims to provide image quality equal to that of the Hubble Space Telescope but over a wider field of view and at a fraction of the cost. Observatory Sciences has provided software for the laser beam launch system, control of many of the new system's optical components, as well as beam diagnostic systems to provide real-time monitoring of its performance. Observatory Sciences consultants spanned four continents working on this cutting-edge multi-conjugate adaptive optics technology for Gemini, producing the control software for each of its four subsystems. December 16, 2011 saw the Gemini South Telescope in Chile produce its first ultra-sharp wide-field image, the highest angular resolution and the widest field of view images ever captured from the ground using laser guide star adaptive optics techniques and equal to anything produced by space-based telescopes at a fraction of the cost. Observatory Sciences providing big science software solutions.